squat variation, we are doing a squat with an upright row. So you have mastered this one because between yesterday's squat clean and jerk and then today's, this is gonna seem so easy. The way this is gonna work is you're gonna do the same type of motion, except we're not gonna reverse that grip at the top of the squat and clean like we did yesterday. So palms are facing your body. We're gonna get down into a low squat, and as we squat, we're going to simultaneously bring those elbows up towards the sky. So squat, upright row, and bring those dumbbells back down to the starting position. So feet are wider than shoulders with distance. Palms facing your body, just right at your mid thigh. Take it down nice and low as you drop down into that low squat. Elbows rise up into that upright row, really hitting the shoulders. So here we go, let's get 10. Here's one, drop those dumbbells as you come back up. Here's two, good. And three, good, elbows up strong. Here's four, beautiful, don't let the core fall out, keep it in nice and tight. Here's five, take it down. Six, elbows up. Seven, down. Eight, nine, good, last one, 10, and back up. Now you can do these a little bit faster so they can look like this. Here's one, two, three, four, five, or I like to do these a little bit slower because as you do them faster, you can start to really target those traps, which is that muscle right here that we tend to try to want to not work as much because as women, those big traps just don't suit us. So I like to do it nice and slow to make sure my form is perfect. So coming up, squeeze, and then coming back down. Nice and slow, keeping the chest lifted. Here's two, good, and three. Really focus on those glutes. Four, last one, bring those elbows up, and five, bring yourself back up. Good job, so as you've seen, hopefully you try something a little bit faster than a little bit slower, and you can see that if you're going fast, you're kind of using a little bit of momentum, and you're pulling a little bit more with those traps as you're coming up. Whereas, if you go a little bit slower, you can focus on the glutes, the hamstrings, and the legs, so use that as your focus, and then upright row as you come down. So you can just tell that you're feeling it a little bit more in those glutes, if you go a little bit slower and controlled versus going for speed. So give those a try today. Let me know what you guys think. Check them off your list. Another day done, another day closer to those beautiful goals. Have an amazing day, and I'll see you guys real soon.